In this video, I'll be showing you how to create an experience management data warehouse by transforming and centralizing your survey responses. My name is Leah Jarrett, and I'm a developer advocate from Google Cloud. Surveys are a powerful tool for all different businesses. Survey platforms allow organizations to easily collect large amounts of data around customer satisfaction, employee happiness, brand awareness, and more. However, surveys are often used once to solve a specific problem, and then the data is forgotten about. Additionally, the shape of the data can be pretty difficult to work with using standard tools like SQL or business intelligence platforms. Here, I'll show you how to use Cloud Data Prep by Trifecta to transform and load survey responses from Google Forms into BigQuery, where you can join them onto additional data sets and perform deeper analysis using tools like Looker or Data Studio. Let's imagine that I'm performing market research for my data analytics company. I've sent out a Google Forms survey that asks respondents questions about their analytics knowledge. Google Forms will automatically push the responses into a Google Sheet. However, if I push the sheet directly into my warehouse, the format would make it difficult to query. Let's take a closer look at this checkbox grid question. In the Google Sheet, one row is recorded for each response, where each grid column is its own column, and the selections are all in one cell, separated by a semicolon. Now what we really want is for one row to represent each selection so that we can easily do things like count the number of people who selected each platform project combination. In Cloud Data Prep, I've created a flow that transforms and loads my responses into BigQuery. I've connected the Google Sheet that contains my survey responses and then created a recipe to clean the column headers. Next, the data is pushed into four different recipes, one for each question type, which transforms the responses based on the format. Let's take a deeper look at the multiple choice checkbox grid question. In my recipe, I can preview the data at each step in my transformation process. I've already deleted the columns that I don't need, and now I want to extract each element from my selection list. First, I'm going to extract the selections into their own individual columns. Next, I can combine these columns into a single array for each response. Now that I have all of my selections in an array, what I need to do is restructure this data so that each selection becomes its own row in the database. And there we have it. My data is now unnested. I can repeat similar transformations for my other formats until I have all of my data loaded into BigQuery. In BigQuery, I can see that Trifacta has pushed those responses into the four tables representing my different types of questions. I can preview the data and see that it's now in the format that I would expect it to make it easier for doing analytics on. And since all this data is centralized in my warehouse, I can easily join it back onto other data sources like the accounts table from my CRM. In Looker, I've created my own dashboard that surfaces insights about this survey to my team. Here I can drill in and see which respondents correspond to accounts already in our CRM and directly reach out to the account owners to let them know. I'm also gonna jump down and drill into my group of users who are data analysts that leverage Python. I'm gonna hop into Looker's Explore environment where I can easily now send this list of users to Marketo and target them for an upcoming launch that we have. And now you know how to create an experience management data warehouse where your organization can take direct action on the insights that they get from survey responses. Thanks for watching.